Once upon a time, there was a little boy named Leo who was learning to count. He loved to play with his blocks, but he didn't know how many he had. Let's learn to count together, Leo, said his mom, smiling warmly. First, we start with the number one. See this bright red block? That's one. It's all by itself, a single block. Leo picked up the red block, his eyes wide with wonder. One, he repeated, sounding proud. Now, let's add another block. Mom continued, placing a blue block next to the red one. One, and one more makes two. Two blocks together. See how they make a little pair? Leo carefully held both blocks. Two, he exclaimed, a grin spreading across his face. Mom continued, adding a yellow block. One, two, and one more makes three. Three blocks, like three yummy gummy bears. They went on, adding blocks of different colors and shapes. With each new block, Mom explained the number, making connections to things Leo already knew. Four blocks, like the four legs of your dog, she said, adding a green block. Five blocks, like the five fingers on your hand, she exclaimed as she added a purple block. Leo giggled, counting his fingers. Then came six, like the six legs of a spider. Seven, like the seven days of the week. Eight, like eight bouncy balls. Nine, like nine fluffy clouds in the sky. And finally, ten. Ten blocks, a whole tower of colorful blocks, strong and tall, just like Leo was getting to be. We counted all the way to ten, Leo. Mom cheered, hugging him gently. Leo held his tower of blocks, a huge smile on his face. He had learned to count, and he knew he could build even taller towers now that he knew how many blocks he had. He felt clever and proud. From that day on, Leo loved counting everything he saw, his toys, the cars on the street, even the stars in the night sky. Counting was fun, and it made him feel like he could do anything.